everybody, it's Vertical Sandwich! Welcome back to Let's Play Persona 3, the FES version. In the last video, we caused the end of the world. <laughs> so, let's not do that again. Instead, let's play around with the social link. Hey, Vertical Gun! Perfect timing! Do you want to get something to eat? I can hear my poor stomach crying sadly! Wonderful, my gourmet friend! Then let's go to ramen shop, that's the place for you! Okay! Alright! Oh, the familiar fish smell fills the restaurant. You and Nozomi ate to pass the time. Seven, eight, nine! Crap, I must have counted wrong before, I'm one person short! Well, they can't make a fool out of me! I'm not going to lose to my brother again! And he begins eating with abandon! Of all that, I think! Whoa, whoa! Ever, s ever see that movie where the thing comes out of the guy's chest? Come on, Vertical, it's your job to laugh at the Gourmet King's dumb jokes. Oh. I don't get it. I felt fine up until just a minute ago. And are you feeling sick? What are you getting at? I'm every bit as healthy as you. You think just because I'm fat that I'm sick? And he seems proud. Don't you worry about me. I consider things like this trials. That's all. You have to undergo certain hardships if you become worthy to enter the paradise. Would you consider our trying to enter the paradise too? And he seems comfortable around me. Our relationship is stronger now. And that's level six. Yeah, noodles don't taste so great after a rewind, do they? I'll have to tell you all about the paradise next time. As for today, why don't we focus on the ramen blessed upon us? In fact, I think a big bowl of porridge might do me good. Wait, huh? How about some of your finest? All right. We got to level six with him. And now Ryoji has returned. And we will have to make our decision now. Hey, long time no see. Midnight's just around the corner. At midnight, I will change from this form into something unrecognizable. Unless you're Yukari, and then you've seen it before. So. Have you reached a decision? Okay. I'll be waiting in his room until midnight. Come see me when you have your answer. Ryoji-kun. Oh, and one more thing. Don't let the fact that you'll have to kill me influence your decision. As I said before, I'm going to disappear anyways. I won't feel any pain by dying. So there's no need to worry about me. I'll be waiting. Have you made your decision? I see. Have the rest of you made your decision? No need to. You know how I feel. I wouldn't be here if I wasn't on board. I'm with the rest of you. I'm in too. I have made my decision as well. Then we're all in agreement, yes? Better let him know then. Okay? All right.
Hey. It's been a long time since we talked like this in your room. Although back then, I didn't appear in this form and wasn't known by this name. Don't tell me you've all decided to let me live. You're all going to risk your lives on a battle you can't win. But you're the only one here right now, so... I'll say this one more time. If you kill me, Tartarus, the Dark Hour, and your memories of the battles will all disappear. Tomorrow, you'll wake up a normal high school student. You'll be able to live in peace until the moment of the fall. But if you let me live, you'll spend every waking moment until that day in fear of your inevitable death. Nyx cannot be defeated. It's useless to fight her. Are you still thinking? Or have you already made up your mind? Okay, this is a very important decision. You must choose wisely. Let Ryoji live. I guess my words didn't change your mind. There's still some time until midnight. I didn't want to have to show you this, but I have no choice. See? I'm not human. I will bring death to this world until I am finally satiated. Do not hesitate to kill me. I want you to think about this carefully. Is facing Nyx really the best decision? Right now, you are all confused by the truth. But some things in this world cannot be changed. You do not understand this yet. Memories are ambiguous. Old ones can be replaced with new ones, creating a new reality. Don't you want to end all your friends' pain and suffering? It's up to you. You're the only one who can make this decision. Now, this is your last chance. Tell me your answer. <sighs> I understand. It's regrettable, but it's your life. You can do what you want with it. I will respect your decision. Let's go back to the lounge. I need to tell you guys how to confront Nyx. Yeah, you do! Yo, what's up, Ryoji? <laughs> <sighs> it's an unfortunate decision, but it is yours to make. That's right. But you can't defeat Nyx. It's impossible. But we must still try. Personally, I don't care if it is impossible. I understand. It's almost midnight, so I'll keep this brief. I'll tell you where to find Nyx. She'll be at Tartarus. You must reach the top of the tower before the promised day. When's the promised day? Exactly one month from tomorrow. January 31st, 2010. Nyx will descend to Tartarus, and the world will end. If you go to the top of Tartarus on that day, you'll be able to face her. The tower exists for the purpose of Nyx's coming. As the appraiser, I usher Nyx into this world. And Tartarus welcomes her arrival. The tower exists for the purpose of Nyx's coming. That's why it's called the Tower of Demise. So if we reach the top, we can fight Nyx? Yes, but remember. From today, you will fight against eternal despair. Like I've said so many times before, Nyx cannot be defeated. When you face her, you will finally understand this truth. And then you will realize what it is you are trying to stand against. 
We understand. There's no need to keep telling us. January 31st. We won't forget that date. Well, I'll be going on ahead of you then. I want to leave you while I'm still in this form. Ryoji-kun. Aegis, I'm sorry for all the pain and suffering I put you through. I won't forget that you were my enemy. And my friend. I guess. Thank you. This will probably be the last time I'll see you all like this. But I'll always be watching over you. Well, goodbye. Yeah, he'll always be watching over us because he's death. <laughs> Best wishes in the coming year. That's what you say on New Year's Eve, right? See ya. <laughs> that Ryoji. All right, a mysterious voice rings in your head. The bond that thou hath nurtured hath finally matured. The innermost power of the Fool Arcana hath been set free. We bestow upon thee the ability to create Susanoo, the ultimate form of the Fool Arcana. The Seas Social Link has reached its maximum level. And we have mastered the, so the Seas Social Link. Our power to create Personas of the Fool Arcana has reached its maximum. And we have forged a bond that cannot be broken. Okay, the full social link is at its maximum level. You can now create Susano O, the Raging God. And we've made an important decision with our comrades. Our relationship with them has grown stronger and reached a new level of closeness. Boom! <laughs> Thou shalt have our blessing when thou chooses to create a persona of the Judgment Arcana. All right, so we've established a new social link. <laughs> this one does not work like anything else we've had before. The way the judgment social link works is it levels up as we climb Tartarus. Like the last section of Tartarus, it's like every 10 levels or something, we get a new level in this, or every 10 levels we get a two levels or something. I, I don't remember, but it's if you get to the top of Tartarus, you've maxed it. In one month, on January 31st, you'll be able to face Nyx. You must reach the top of Tartarus by that day. This is the decision you have all made. 2009 is quietly drawing to a close. It was a year filled with many memories. Senpai. Happy New Year. Let's make this the best year ever. It's New Year's, but there's nothing really special to do. Well, you can always wish people a New Year's greeting. Like, uh, have a great year. Yeah. Happy New Year to you too, Koro. Oh man, I completely overslept. Why'd I stay up all night watching that stupid movie? Did you guys see it? It had these giant Amazon women running around in the jungle. Why would I watch that? Why wouldn't you? Um, is anyone gonna visit the shrine? No, I don't believe in superstitions. Me either. Oh, that's too bad. Yukari-san and the others are already there. They're all wearing kimonos. Kimonos, huh? Uh, I'm gonna run to the store. Hold it right there, Junpei. Uh, what? 
You're going to the shrine, aren't you? No, I'm not. I'm, uh, I'm just going for a walk. Oh, yeah? Well, I'm going with you then. I'm bored. Oh, I'll go too. All right, then. Let's go. You coming? Anyone know where it is? Yeah, the girl told me the directions. No, I know, I know where the shrine is. We all know where the shrine is. Sweet. to leave Yucatan <laughs> What Happy New Year Hmm What's the matter Yori Mitsuru senpai You look hot I um <laughs> I mean Stop staring at me Um I've never worn a kimono before. Does my sash look okay? Fuga, you look... Wow! Jeez. <laughs> this traditional clothing is quite interesting. However, it's difficult to move in. The girls seem to be embarrassed about their clothing. I'm so glad I came. <laughs> New Year's kicks ass. Yeah. I think there's a New Year's tradition in Japan to for live performances of uh, Beethoven's Ninth Symphony as well, which I think is amazing. Like, I'd love to see a live performance of Beethoven's Ninth. Junpei-san, why are you acting so strange? Man, we got to see some great stuff today. Right, Akihiko Senpai? Uh, I, uh, I guess so. Hey, aren't you guys cold? Mm, a little, but I love this time of year. Um, that's not what I meant. Junpei-san said that you guys aren't wearing anything underneath your kimonos. He said what? Ow! All right, we can talk to people. How could Stupe say such a thing to a kid? But you know, it's nice to do this sort of thing once in a while. Let's take positive thoughts and hope for the best results. I drew a paper fortune and it read great luck. I'm anticipating excellent results. <laughs> do you want to leave? I'll stay a little longer. All right, let me know if you want to leave. Why do I have to let her know if I want to leave? That's weird. Don't you hate getting the worst luck fortune? I feel like he's the reason my luck is so bad. Maybe I should break up with him. I pulled the fortune out and it was worst luck. It's not a little way to start the new year. Okay, we can't talk to that person. Arf, arf. Dude, I didn't say that. Don't make things up. But you, but you. Yeah. Okay, so I can go to the town map. Wearing this makes me feel renewed. Although the sash makes it hard to breathe. But why do I have to talk to- why- why can I leave talking to her, but I can also go to the town map? Oh! What did you wish for, Fuka? I- I wished for a great year. 
It's a bit generic, but that's what I really want. That's what I want as well. How <laughs> funny. We all wished for the same thing. But it wasn't a plea for help. I know that we'll be victorious. We should get going. Okay, our cell phone is ringing. Hello, this is Elizabeth. Calling to inform you of a change in Tartarus. I believe a path that was blocked is now open. Thought you would like to know. I wish you a safe journey. And if our status is great, we're going tonight. It's good. How's everybody else doing? Everyone's okay today. Let's go to Tartarus. Because we have to do a ton of stuff in Tartarus in one month. Like a ton of stuff. It's ridiculous all the garbage we're going to have to do. Like we have to level up a bunch. And I think there's going to be new Elizabeth requests. But I don't think... Form last judge. Three platinum medals. So we need that, just in case we see these guys. We get up two more levels, we can do Lilith with Mabufu Dine. But we need to retrieve the bloody button, which is, this is a difficult request. Defeat the Reaper and retrieve one bloody button. So I need to explain this. So the way that this works is the when when Fuka says, I feel death approaching, this monster comes out at like a random encounter, starts roving around the floor, and if it hits you, you have to fight the Reaper. And the Reaper is overpowered. The Reaper is almost impossible to kill. There's a few strats for killing the Reaper. I've done it. And it's it's rough. The, I mean, the reward's 5 million yen. But you, we have to kill him first. So that's the thing we have to do this month. Is kill the Reaper. So. Um, yeah. There's that. So I'm more interested in in climbing Tartarus, uh, leveling up Judgment a bit, and getting some levels so we can do some Persona fusions that are really worth uh, the work we're putting in. Because, you know, some things like getting better, you know, getting better special weapons would be cool. Getting... Uh, some of the, the some of the far stronger personas, like the late level. Where's my list? The late level judgment ones. Uh, we need an Aeon persona at some point. Some of those things would be huge deals. And some of the late level sun ones are pretty cool too. So when we come back, we're in Tartarus, and it's open. Almost all the way to the top now. Bye, everybody.